Uh, hello everyone and welcome to this shit fest. Uh, I, you would not believe the shit I had to go through to try and get this thing to record. So if the video looks different, it's because Fraps wouldn't recognize this as a game. So I had to go through several different programs to finally find one that would record it. So hopefully it works okay. Anyway, so uh, what this idea is, is I've played through all 29 of the Nancy Drew games. I have my friend here, Mike, who has no idea about any of them <laughs> and has never played a point and click in his life. So he's going to try and get through as many as he can, I guess, throughout the summer, and uh, hopefully he'll start to enjoy them. Yeah, we'll make no, him, not going to happen, but... We'll make him a fan. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a console gamer, so... Exactly. Don't freak out on me. I'm, I have no idea what I'm doing. Yeah, so yeah, the first couple games here might be a little bit bad with navigation, but other than that, uh, let's start this thing. No new game. You probably want to start Junior because... I'm already the... lost. I don't even know how to get through the damn Dear menus. Dad, who would have dreamed taking a semester off to out visit Aunt Eloise in Florida would result in another case? Seems a student was murdered at the high school last night. And Daryl Gray, the student council oh, the president, the Yeah, I know. Oh. This is the only game that has it like this. Oh, Afterwards, no. they're like CGI. The he asked if I would try I mean, it's, it's pretty it ugly, walk. yeah. So it's undercover I go. My only contact is Daryl. So I'm off. I like how they told her, uh, like Daryl, that she was an undercover detective. Like he was the one who found the body. He isn't a suspect. No, just tell her. This looks like the colored take on me video. So there you go, okay. Uh, red means you can click on something, and blue at the edges of the screen mean you can turn. Holy Just God, ignore that, that. Yeah, I know. If you read to do any research, key to the library is in the safe. You can find the combination in the house if you need it. Why doesn't you in just the house? Tell her? Yeah, in the house. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely done. How do I how do I go back to the uh, there you go. There you Got go. it. Yeah. So in the house. In the house. Great detail. Right. Indeed. I also will be trying not to give him many hints. We're gonna try and see how he does in his own. Is this the key? Did I already find it? No. Oh, it's fine. a phone card. It lets you call people with a payphone. It's kind of useless, but. Get out of here. There we go. So yeah, move you in one click, and that turns you. So. That's, you can't get out. And that door leads to the outside, so I wouldn't go there yet. It's in the house. It's in the house. It's in the house. Descriptive. Yep. Well, I think she's supposed to have known her aunt for a while, so... So, yeah. I guess she just assumes she knows where the, the code well, is. I don't know. She put in the detail that it's in the house, so... I mean, why didn't she just tell her when she invited her here? We have to close the drawer. Oh, you gotta close the yeah, drawer. Yeah, you gotta close it. Close it up. Can't leave that drawer open. No. That's the same oh, thing. Oh, back to the same drawer. It was here already. You did. see here. <laughs> He's experiencing difficulty already. Yeah, this, this is basically my experience with point and click. Yeah. Ah, it gets better. You wanna look at that. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Scenery. Is there anything in here I can steal? Uh, there is. So more books. Go on a nice pixel hunt. It's a good idea to run your thing over the entire screen to make sure you don't miss anything. Uh, no, not that fast. <laughs> oh, the TV, the TV remote. remote and this. Docks. Docks, yeah. Do I have to go to this? Is that why it's in the game? Uh, no. Close it's, that drawer. Just keep exploring. Attention to detail in this. It's exquisite. It's the first game. I think this was released in like 98. You can give it a pass. Okay. Look up and down too. You can. Amazing. You missed. <laughs> you need to go way slower for shit. See this this patience thing. It's like... There you go. What? I know it's kind of weird. Holy crap! 
What's so important about this key that it needs to be hidden in a book? It's not that important, actually. Frick. What is this even the key to again? I can't even remember. It's not the key to the library. That's not the key. I'll tell I can't you even that remember. Right now. All right, that's the key to the library is in the safe. I need the safe. That's that's not the key to the library. Is that what I'm looking for? Yeah. Can I go there? What the fuck is this? There you go. Uh, you. <laughs> She's one of these. I would have been here. I would have been here all day. She's one of these paranoid people. Didn't look. Key to the safe. No, you. Is it to... Gox? Yeah. Try it. You have to punch in a combination. That's an S, not a G. But okay. Okay. Where's the G? G's right there. That's a six. It's not. I think you messed up. I think you gotta... Here, back out of it and go for it again. There you go. <laughs> oh, okay. S. S? No, wrong S. What do you mean wrong S? Should be that one in the corner. That's not an S, that's a... Oh. I don't know what the hell that it's, is. It's it. They're Latin symbols. I should have went back and looked again. Should have. Oh, money. You can put the key down. It doesn't do anything yet. I don't know how to put it. <laughs> Just down. click it and you're there. Oh, look at this. Yeah, a good old slider for us. Breaking in. You've done one of these before, haven't you? Yeah. Not in ten years. I'm not very good at them either. Yeah. See, in like senior and master detective, it's like 12, 15 it needs to pieces. Go up there. Yeah. There, you got it. Just move those over to the left. Oh! <laughs> you got was that, was it. That, like, that was the highlight of the game this Pretty far. much, yeah. yeah like so, a uh. Got a pen. Should probably write shit down. Eloise, oh wise out there. I got cards. Is there a book anywhere to write this shit down? Just put it on a card. Just give me like one card. That's all I need. Okay, go for it. I can write it down on the side. Okay, keep going. Uh, who are we here? Common password, oh wise elder. Yeah. Catchy. Easy to remember. Oh wise elder. Yeah. I don't know. She strikes me as a very paranoid person. She just hides, like, literally everything everywhere. Yeah, she's got the personality of somebody from a 90s point and click, doesn't she? Pretty much. I want that key, too. That's the one to the library in there. That one? The silver key. Or, no, the one okay. you just took. Is what the is the other key library. for you? Ah, uh, something in this house. I'll tell you, because it's completely useless. I think you get, like, a quarter out of it, so you can... How do I go out of this? Thing? Click the thing closed. There, now you can back out. God, is this not the mess? <laughs> it's in the living room. Again, this is really not that important. That would important. be the living room? Yeah, it's not that important in mystery anyway. Yeah, isn't this a mystery of some sort? Yeah, there's also a TV up there. Is it in here? I want to take that's, a nice, that's the TV. I'm gonna take a nice look at this TV. Very CR TV. Oh, yeah. What is that? It's like a 15-inch. Yeah, that's pretty brutal. And the good old, the good old VCR. God. But you gotta find a tape first. Turn to the right, other side, other way. I'm right taking the long, way around. the long way around. Then. There, trunk in the corner. I need something to make this work. Do you? Is that right? Yeah, you do. And yeah, like I said, you literally get a quarter out of it. So you can play pinball and change the jukebox at the diner here, and that's about it. Thank goodness. That's literally all you get. Can I go to the library yet? Yeah, you can go wherever you want. Can I? Because it seems like I'm trapped in this house. Uh, so Ooh. those are the places. There's the pharmacy, there's the diner where Daryl is, there's the school, Darryl? and then there's Emily's house. He's the blonde guy in the intro. Oh. It doesn't matter where you go, but if you do go to the, the school, you have to insert disc two. Everywhere else is disc one. So does it keep my key? Yeah, you keep everything. Well, how it's, the heck does that work? Technology. <laughs> you probably have a purse or a bag or something to keep it all in. Okay, so where do you think I should go? In your educated. Well, Daryl was the one who found the body, so you might want to talk to him first.
Yeah, oh. there he is. That anime. <laughs> Awe inspiring. Yeah. You look like you're going to make an excellent addition oh my to God. Paseo Del Mar High School student body. Do I? <laughs> he I looks cross-eyed. What the hell is going on? He looks a lot of things. Student council president and professional escort to pretty new. So people. yeah, scroll down here to find more responses, and then you can just Dude, talk really to them. I think so. As much as you want to click on see you later, you should probably talk to him. What are you trying to do? No, you just click on them. You don't hit the keys. Click on what? Professional S Yes. At your service. I'm a man of many it's talents. For it. Whoever or whatever you want. I'm the one for you. Let's just get right to the point. Who was murdered? Let's just get right well, to it. I want to know about Jake Rogers' no, locker. Fine. <laughs> Go Who was murdered? A student named Jake Rogers. When I found him, it looked like someone had pushed him face first down a flight of stairs. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <and nasty. laughs> the school's not closed either. There's like a bunch of people still in the school. Even like, like a murder occur occurred Clearly, yesterday. That right there is the face of somebody who found a dead body. <laughs> right look at his smug ass. Goes right back to work. Click on the T. Tell me about Jake. He wasn't exactly a friend. He came by the diner a few times. Nancy, I hate to leave such a beautiful detective, Ugh. but I've got a hot grill waiting for me. See you later, okay? And then he continues to wash the glass. <laughs> he's just yeah, a, he's, a, he's a, just a liar. Got there. He's just a liar. So we can just throw out whatever he told us. Okay, so this is there's a bunch of like hidden clues hidden in the game that help you. Like is that with one, it. five, ten, eleven sort of thing? It's Jake. It spells his name. Win in like alphabet. Okay. But like there's a bunch of them that they can give you hints or just kind of provide backstory. I'm calling right now, he's the one who murdered him. <laughs> Daryl Gray. Calling it. Same thing. Yeah, pretty much. Is there anything else here that's even worth my time? Yeah, there's quite a bit here. Oh. Well, should um, I be should I be working on this unit here? Well, it, it's just a hidden clue. Like I said, all it does is spell out Jake. It's like an Easter egg kind of thing, ish, ish, ish. Cakes. You can go into the kitchen if you want. I want cake. Ooh, and suddenly the kitchen turns ominous. Again, try yeah, running. Somebody get murdered running. back here. <laughs> Apparently, clean up oil spills. A nice soup ladle. Thank God. I would have taken the knife for protection. Can't. Well, it wouldn't surprise me if you could. Yeah. One of these days, I'm gonna find a clue looking up. <laughs> One of these days. Got a pretty narrow field of view, doesn't she? So yeah, walking, not a lot of peripheral vision. Walking like right up to stuff to see it. <laughs> not a whole lot of anything here. I think it turned red back there for a second. I like how someone took the time to carve watch out in the cutting board. Like someone well, had a bad day at work or something like that. <laughs> Yeah, it's gotta be that freaking guy at the <laughs> Daryl hates his job, so we killed the student. <laughs> yeah, I don't know him, but I'm gonna kill him. If I find out that he knows him. So again, that on the bottom is another, like, Holy clue there. crap. I can tell you what it means, because I figured it out already. It says, Jake's, Jake's, something. Jake's fate happened deliberately. Gravity was not his worst enemy. So basically, like... He, well, he didn't just fall and accidentally kill himself. Yeah, but he was like, who, who wrote that? I mean, exactly. That's one of the main like things in the game that kind of annoys me. Like, do people work here that it's, give hints? I, it's, I think this is the only game that has it. Possibly 2 does too. But yeah, it makes no sense. Because like, some of them refer to events that happen in the future too. So it's like, I guess whoever wrote them was psychic. Because they knew what you were going to be doing. Is there anything else in this room? There is, actually. I'm probably going to tell you where it is because it's a really bad pixel hunting kind of thing. Wait, I want to read these rules. Sure. Refill salt and pepper shakers. <laughs> Watch. One will just be like, Jake was murdered deliberately or something like that. <laughs> I don't think so. Rule number 17 of the kitchen. Lock up the freezer. <laughs> uh, turn back to the cutting board. And now click on that pipe underneath. The pipe? Yeah, it's pretty what ridiculous. 
Now there's gas escaping, so you gotta put something in its place. The soup plate. Sure, go for it. There you go. Now the music turns happy again. I should've just let the gas leak go. <laughs> it blows off. You like Good. instantly lose as soon as you leave the kitchen. <laughs> That'll show Daryl what's what. <laughs> I think you can talk to him again, if you want. Who would want to talk to him? That's another thing in this game. When they tell you to get lost, I, my uh, I guess you have anything else to say. When they tell you to get lost, just go up to him and talk to him again because they don't really care. See you later. Take care, detective. God. He Give just, he attitude. literally sits here the entire game cleaning that one glass. So we should check him out for like <laughs> mental health issues. Uh, Alright. So what do you want to do? Go to school? I, or Vandalite? No, I don't want to put in disc 2. I'm too lazy. Well, it's literally the only place you can go right now. You can go to Vandalite, but literally nothing happens there until the climax of the game. That's the only reason it's there. You can, you can click on it, but it's literally nothing. I just want to see what's in here. Close for inventory. It's all missing. Pretty dreary anyway. looking Florida. So click click on the school. You gotta click yeah, on it first. There you go. Ugh. This is the only game that does this, so... The animation is too much. It's overwhelming, isn't it? Yeah, it's too much data on one disc with all that high definition. <laughs> HD. 180 HD. <sighs> the school's pretty huge, so you might get lost. There's like... Four different hallways you can go down, so just just inform me. A whole total of four hallways. Yeah, well, it, it can get confusing. Yeah, I can imagine. I couldn't even find my way out of that house. <laughs> Fighting manatees. That's their, their football team. That's apparently really good. Are they? Apparently. Yeah, again, I think of football, I think of fighting. One of the guys. suspects in it is like their quarterback, and he's like just doesn't stop talking about how good he is. Is it Daryl? Daryl no, seems like a pretty cocky guy. It's not Daryl, no. Daryl's like the party guy that everyone likes. I don't like him. So yeah, these billboards are filled with like those hidden clues there. You can click on that again. Hal Tanaka. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you can click that's on like that a, that's again. That's almost racist. And, yo, believe me. <laughs> so this one... Hang on. Yeah, figure it out. This one's pretty easy. Figured out yet? I'm still reading. I've got to figure out where one word ends and the next one begins. Yeah, it's just spaced. Yeah. Sorry, he people. He wants to figure this out himself. And discover uh, another crime. The answer is in black. And white. Well, I would hope so. It's paper. <laughs> all right. You get it? Yeah. What did it say? I gotta find some sort of paper. That's all I got. Find the morning edition to discover another crime. The answer is in black and white. To who will do the time? That's what it says. Oh, and you need a Yeah, they did most of them do. Right? Can't go to the cafeteria. You can go to the locker if you want. Just, just That's Jake Jake's guys. locker, I would imagine, with the police tape on it. It didn't exactly make much of an but effort to... Yeah. You need to know his combo, though, first to be able to get into it. So you can't get into it right now. Fifteen years. Huh? Where does it say that? Look at that. You get a sentence up to fifteen years. For right? breaking into some kid's locker. Yeah. <laughs> Those are the stairs that he fell down in case you... You can't actually go up them, which makes no sense that she wouldn't investigate the place that he was pushed from. No, no, that's just the crime but scene. But I guess, I don't know. Not overly important. First, third Wednesday of the month. Is there any concept of time in this game? Or? No, it all happens in one day. No, the rate I'm playing it. In the later games, there is concept of time, but not in this one. Everyone literally just sits there until you talk to them. Yeah, like and out. yeah, literally everyone does that. Let's see what's this way. Whoa. So the student union and the study dome are that way. If you want to go that way. I'm still looking for this paper. <laughs> uh, oh, the clues. Yeah. 
I, I think it just says see search search beneath what does that one say search beneath danger sign that's just telling you to get the bolt cutter we already got that so it doesn't really Oh, at the, the diner, at the diner it says search beneath danger sign. So it's stuff like that that tells you what to do. So this is oh, a look study look at us, dome. we're just on the ball. Even okay. though you told me already that it was there. Wow, it's really hard to find if you don't know what you're doing. Oh, uh, what the hell is that? Oh, uh, to decode... It's backwards, I believe. To decode his... Name... name just find phone. a phone. Oh, uh, God. Phone, phone was... Was part of... Was part of his fame. Jake's... Locker. Locker. Combo. Combo. So, find a phone, something about Jake's locker combo. That's important. It is important, if you want. The trash bin. Someone just Look in the trash. Evidence in the trash. That's where Jake was discarded. Of. Ah, oh, yes. it's Mr. Time for George racist, racist stereotypes. Hi, your face. Hi, my name's Hal. You oh, sure wow. arrived on a day with a lot of activity. He seems shook up about the whole murder thing too. Look at that face. No one can oh. close their mouth in this game. It's ridiculous. Like, can you imagine <laughs> if you went to talk to this guy and he looked at you like that? <laughs> just a blank expression. His mouth face? hanging open. This I guy doesn't look like any honest dude I've ever seen. To me, the face reveals a lot about a person. What does my face tell what you? Is, yeah, what is this face? <laughs> Did you ever study? Jesus, these questions are a little blonde. The, the guy who was killed? Oh, yeah. Jake Rogers was a dark soul. He was a dark he soul. He created a lot of dark trouble. Souls. Dark soul. What a metaphor. There's his mouth again. Oh! I think he's having a stroke or something. Dark soul? Jake wasn't a happy person, and made others around him very unhappy too. You probably didn't need to read his face to tell that. Look at those puckered lips, he's looking How for a Jake kiss. People around <laughs> him There's a skate. I feel uncomfortable speaking about this now. Please, excuse, excuse me. me. I think I'm behind in my studies, uh, and I must get back to the library. And then he Fine, proceeds to sit here for the entire game. So there's no library happening. Let me continue here. to sit here and doodle. <laughs> he's Helping not, me cope He's with really the not murder. writing, is he? Yeah. Nice eyeglasses just left on the table. Probably his. The guy. Uh, senior prom. That's the maintenance room. You need a code to get in there, too. Oh, God. You can go look at the phone if you want. That, that, there was a phone? It would turn around. You never went into I'm the student union. Oh. You're right in there. Oh, yeah, look at that. There's a... Oh, freak. Well, yeah. The awesome. Big, it's a really ugly logo. I'm sorry. Just... Uh, Who's this? That would be Connie. This twerp. Hi, I'm Connie. Yeah, it is Connie. Around here. Yeah, yeah, I know this game, too. Usually, Paseo Del Mar High is really quiet and boring. Today, it's totally out of control. There's, like, four people here. Yeah, like, out of control. It's out of control for this high school, I guess. There's, again, police. Why wouldn't they close down the school and be doing some uh, investigating? The only guy here is that Hal. Hal's kicking around, but that's about it. Is it that so obvious? Out of control. It's a small school. Nothing ever happens here. A new student is big news. You mean like the guy who got like murdered? Like the guy who got night? murdered, yeah. It's not <laughs> like that's in the news. Bro, there isn't though. There's no activity. The hallways are empty. For a small school. There was a lot of activity. activity. Animation would be able to handle. It. Don't worry. <laughs> the game would just Once break. Once this whole thing blows over, it'll be back to the same old routine. Ooh, that's pretty cold. <laughs> it'll blow over. It's just a dead kid. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Are you forgetting one of your classmates <laughs> was just murdered this morning? Hey. Jake's luck ran out. She got pretty That's damn offensive there. <laughs> Life goes on. Ooh. I don't know. Starting to look pretty suspicious here. Between her and Daryl, I don't know. <laughs> Is there more to like Jake's murder than knows. just bad luck? Jake Rogers brought it on himself. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he pushed I himself down the stairs. You can click on her again and continue talking if you want. What's up, Nancy? Do you know Hal Tanaka? Not very well. 
He's an exchange student from Japan and a total workaholic. He told me he's trying to get a scholarship for college. Lately, he's looking really burnt out. I what think the pressure. pressure is getting to him. There's no pressure trying to get into college in the States. <laughs> <laughs> you got money? All right. How well do you know Daryl Gray? I wish I knew him better. He's the only guy I'd ever consider dating. He's student council Turned president. Turned on by his dishwashing cool ability. Job <laughs> call Maxine. His ability to wipe down glass is just extraordinary. He drives a Porsche 911. Whoa, that's... <laughs> yeah. Sure he does. <laughs> Th that... You know, these are all pretty solid questions. Do you know the combination to Jake Rogers' locker? Why would I have known the combination of that jerk's locker? Why are you asking so many questions, Nancy? Or You're not working for the police, are you? I gotta yes, go now. Indeed. Later. You can talk to her again. She Why keeps sending the guess not. What's going on, <laughs> it's, Nancy? It's Goodbye. Down. Bye, Nancy. Maybe I wanted to keep talking. Senior prom. Enchantment under the stars. Baron theme. This is true. <laughs> What is the, <laughs> the stars anyway? I don't it's know. It's pretty vague. Uh, look at all the fashion magazines. The sound. <laughs> look at them. Rocking out hardcore. Uh, who's that? Is that Clarissa? Mm -hmm. Clarissa knows it all. <laughs> you still remember that shit? Not really. Neopolitan. I have no interest in any of these. No, nor, there, nor did there's, I have any in real there's, life. There's no interest in these magazines whatsoever. Like, am I supposed to find something? No, here? they're just to look at. Thank God. <laughs> Ooh, look at that judo tournament. Guys and dolls. I hope it's not anything like a doll's house. It wouldn't be. I don't think. I Guys and not. dolls. I hope not. Battle of the bands. Ooh. This is a pretty active school for someone with like eight students. <laughs> I don't know where everyone else is. Like, what? they just all got up and left. It looks like freaking yeah. He, it looks like they abandoned the school. Like, who's who's is this? What a clutter! <laughs> they just leave their books there yeah. over the weekend. It's that well, kind time of to go home. Just get up and walk out. Students there. of the month. These are the these are the twelve or ten students of the school. I think this guy. This guy looks like a. Yeah, some of them look like like is she a student? October? She's well over. <laughs> She's got to be. Is she still in high school? You December? You're the month taking grade 12 for the 8 billionth time. <laughs> uh, this is freaking gay. <laughs> That's the teacher's lounge. You'll have to get in there at some point. Oh, right. I have the key to the library, don't I? You do. There's a lot to do in the school, though. Am I gonna ever leave this place? Yeah, you're gonna have to. It's right on the side there, I think. Where? Uh, now for soccer? No. Teach. Teacher's lounge. There you go. So you, it just tells you you gotta well, get into the teacher's in lounge. I wanted to get in there anyway, but... Yeah, and you can use the phone if you keep turning. There we go. That's the wrong phone. You gotta keep oh, turning. the wrong phone? Yeah. You can just call random numbers you find if you want. Slide your card through. That phone card that you got? I got a phone. Oh, right. I did get a phone card. And just I? slide that through, and then you got unlimited caller. <laughs> Just back out. I tried to physically slide it through. You can call. You can call some of your friends in this game, but they don't really say much. Uh, you can ask for hints. Ned Nickerson. That's her boyfriend. Ugh. And then the other two are her friends. They're in like every game. So why'd you get the pound key? I don't know. Who should should I phone somebody or no? It doesn't really matter. Cause they said <clears> something <throat> about the phone. They said something about Jake's locker and the phone. So what, the combo should be around here somewhere or something. Or do I have to phone somebody? Don't know. Maybe I have to phone his combo. Phone his combo. You can call 555 yeah. Tony if you want. It's actually pretty funny. I it's, again, a completely work. racist Italian to stereotype. To This is Donnie's a pizza. <laughs> 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 
Do you think that guy is actually Italian? I don't. Sounds like some guy just doing a stereotype. Uh, All right, I gotta find this library. You do. This isn't the stairs you, you can't, fell down. You can't go upstairs. It's it was the other stairs. All right, where is this library? That's the exit door. You don't want to go out there yet. Man, they got a lot of trophies. They're very poorly rendered trophies. Oh. Well, that's an interesting quote. I already saw this. Is there something in that trophy cabinet back there no. that I should check No, you out? can click on it to look at the really poorly rendered shit. But I would love to. You can go to the gym on the other side of the school. Like, 3D. Oh. They're trying. You gotta give you them gotta a give for them try. trying. Yeah, it's the first game. Groundbreaking stuff here. Give them a pass. They've won in literally everything. And yet they're Pulling a small rows. school. Yeah, all, those ten kids, you know. You can go down this way. This way leads to the gym. I'm looking for the library. Well, that's... Oh, no. Sorry, wrong way. This is just a Jake's locker. Sorry. Okay, Even right. I get lost. There, there we go. go. There okay, go. all right. Now we're, we're getting somewhere here. Uh, what does that say? I think you have to read it from the bottom up, but I'm not. If you can read this. I can't tell, it's too poorly written. Yeah, pretty much. I'm just gonna start up here again somewhere. Skate. Skate. I don't think it's. I see. S steak. Steak. The last word is you'll make. Alright. Victor, no. Yeah, that was the bottom letter. Detective you'll make. Something detective. Class. Class detective you'll make. First class detective you'll make. Wow. I would have loved to read the bottom. Must yeah, be very important I... important in there. I don't think it's that important. If you can read... Is that, is that a... That's an I right there, isn't it? Uh, no. That right there is... Uh, so like that's the T and that's the I and it doesn't look like either of them. I don't know. I honestly don't. The X is just a smudge. I, it's not that important. I guarantee you it won't tell you pretty much anything. Pretty much anything. That's a locker room. You can't go in there. You gotta get a good look at that manatee. I don't know what I'm Let's go for a quick workout on the case. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Holy crap. Look at that spinning football animation. This guy is the quarterback. Whoa! A new girl in school. <laughs> oh. Do you realize what destiny has brought you today? Yours truly, Hector Hulk Sanchez. Hulk Sanchez. Hulk Sanchez, hey? How'd you know I was new here, even though you've never seen me before? How did you know I was new Look here? Look at him, he's stuck! <laughs> hey, you're talking to the man, the number one football player in the state of Florida. I know all Apparently. the beautiful girls at Paseo Del Mar High. Are you kidding? If he's such a huge football player, and this is such a small school, why would he be playing for it? Wouldn't he's, he be going somewhere that has, like, a really good football program? No, he thinks he's the best because there's five people in the school, and he's the best player. <laughs> he's the best player. Look at him, man. For someone who's such a great football player, he has trouble moving outside of conversation, <laughs> There's no agility to be seen here. <laughs> Who do you play for? Couldn't be the fighting manatees. That'd just be embarrassing. Who do you play for? <laughs> you are new around here. I play for the manatees. Oh, yeah. One of the best teams in the state. <laughs> this is Florida again. leave the others in the dirt, man. Soon it's college ball. Ooh. And then... His Miami goal is the Miami Dolphins. Showtime. Shooting high. No, it's not. I <laughs> know. I was being sarcastic. You could, yeah, you could get into that. So I'll play for him now, you piece of turkey. <laughs> The manatees? What are that? What's that? The manatees? Paseo Del Mar's mascot is a manatee. Don't tell me you're afraid <laughs> of a little sea cow. No, but I don't think it's intimidating no. to other teams either. Nobody's afraid of a sea cow. <laughs> I'm scared of them. Aren't they really dangerous? 
Go with that, please. Well, um, actually, I'm scared of them. Aren't they really dangerous? <laughs> You're not from Florida, are you? There's nothing to be afraid of. Manatees are the friendliest underwater sea cows. They're the around. only sea cows around. I've been trying to get the coach to change that friendly lame mascot cows. ever what since I first Oh, at least he's been trying to make progress here. <laughs> <laughs> he's asking to change it, and I agree he's with him. He's so them. proud of it, yet he's, he's not. To change it. Is there anything you fear? <laughs> Getting murdered? Hulk, is there anything you fear? Me? When I walk down the halls, it's punks like Jake Rogers who fear me. Yeah. Why well, does everyone hate <laughs> this guy? Because he was, do? He was a huge douchebag. You'll find out no, later in the game. No, this guy's a huge douchebag. No, well, everyone pretty much is, but like Jake Rogers is a pretty big d-bag. Well, I'm trying to solve this murder. <laughs> Just sweep it under the carpet. <laughs> sweep it under the rug. Pretty much everyone else is trying to. Do you have yeah, any enemies? Nobody else seems to care. My only enemies are on the field. Off the field. I'm a pussycat. Yeah, if you say Is there so. anything else I can enlighten you on? What is what's in his cheek? Is he like chewing yeah, or look something? Yeah, right there, hey. Like, it looks like he has a huge dip in his mouth or Maybe something. He's just got a deformed chin. Like a huge zit on his cheek. Why are there so many police here today? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't see any, but I, can, I can, <laughs> Didn't even see a patrol car. I could probably throw up a pretty good guess. I guess you'd have to be pretty tough to be number 1. Listen, sweetheart, to be the best, you gotta be aggressive and show them who's boss. Like the guy who killed him. <laughs> oh yeah, commend him. <laughs> Sounds like a great guy. Oh god, this school. <laughs> Showed him who was boss. Do you enjoy showing people who's boss? That's a boss? way to talk about someone who's murdered. You have to be aggressive to survive in this world. Jake just couldn't cut it, that's all. I don't find these conversations <laughs> enjoyable at all. <laughs> How well did you know Jake Rogers? I knew Jake, but I didn't hang out with him. You just Sorry, said that he can't was a total talk turd. now. I gotta go to practice. You can later. talk to him again. Did you say anything useful ever? I think so. How's it going? <laughs> <laughs> that was a good read. It sounded like the guy was about to burst into laugh. <laughs> I was like, oh, How's man. it going? How could I get into Jake's locker? I could tear the door off with my teeth, but it might be easier to just ask Hal Tanaka. His locker was right next to Jake's. Yep. Well, what can you tell terrific. me about Connie Watson? She hangs out at the gym a lot. I heard she's been having a real tough time. Tough time? You should probably ask about the tough time. Hmm. Tough time? I heard she's been having a cash flow problem. I <laughs> should get a job with Daryl. <laughs> Apparently he drives a Porsche. Bye. Hey, Bye, gotta Nancy. talk about the other people. How's Literally it? ask everything you can. Do it's, you know how to It's how you get information. That dude is always studying. He's a huge fan of mine. Real smart guy. But I never understood why a brain like Tanaka would hang out with slime like Jake Rogers. Slime. slime. Don't speak ill of the dead. Ben? Tanaka never missed a game. That is, until he started hanging out with Jake. I was a friend of Jake's. You told me about Daryl Gray. I was a friend of Jake's. How was a friend of Jake's? Let's just say I saw them talking together a lot. Jake's locker was right next to Hal's. No, that was the now that I think of, of it, last time I saw them together, Hal seemed pretty upset. Probably go talk uh -oh. to Hal again. It's too late. Gotta ask what everything. What can you tell no, me about you Daryl Gray? He seems like a cool guy. His family used to sponsor the annual football awards dinner until last year. You know, he's the one who found Jake's body. Which again begs the question, why did they let him in on Bye. all of this? Bye, why is he working at a diner if he drives a Porsche and has a rich family? Uh, you missed that conversation. Good. Connie tells you about it. Apparently his, his family was just really popular and had a lot of money, but then they went bankrupt because they weren't very good businessmen. Oh, terrific. So, yeah. <laughs> 